We continue working on the down command. Uh, for me, it's command plus because I, I compete in a sport and I prefer that command. Uh, and uh, we're still working on, on shaping the behavior, which I think is pretty much he, he got it. So now I need to introduce uh, the word, the command. And I also want to make sure when I say the word, the dog is exactly how I want him. So if he's crooked or if he's not fully down, I don't want to say that word because I don't want to associate the command with the wrong uh, position of the body. And so you, you'll see me how we work today, but I think he's, he's getting much better. He's older now and it's a lot easier to work with him than when he was a very little puppy and had short attention span, right? Okay, and so still we do it from the command sit. And so he knows already I don't need to say it because he follows my hand. Good. See, he, he, he knows already. And what's also important is that he's a hyper dog and I try to be very calm when I'm shaping behavior. See, right now he's crooked. I'm not gonna reward it and I'm not gonna say the, the word that just to point it out. Um, but because I need to shape the behavior, I need the dog to think and I want him to be much calmer. That's why I do it with the treats. Once he knows the command and we need to speed it up, then I'll probably switch to uh, doing with the toys and then that way we can build the speed of the command. But let's try again. Come on. Flats. Ah, flats. Good. Good flats. He's straight. He did, did well. I was too quick to say the command. He was slightly crooked. Come on. Flats. Good. Come on. Try again. Come on. No. He's crooked again. His front paw goes under him. No. Come on. Good. Flats. Good blots. Good blots. Also, well, I didn't see his paw. He's supposed to be straight. Also, what helps is that instead of putting the foot underneath him, make him stretch, and then his body becomes a bit straighter. That's another thing I uh, noticed with him. Come on, try again. Come on, try again. No, you're not supposed to be on your side. Come on. Good plots. Try again. See, at first it's a little bit tricky, but then you get it. Come on. And then the dog figures it out too. Come on. Plots. Plots. Good plots. Plots. Good plots. 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 Good plots. Now when he was in a perfect position, I held him and I kept repeating the command so he knows, he start, starts remembering the command. Come on, try again. No, not like that. I need to help him understand that he can go on this side. That's why I'm fixing him right away. And I'm telling him no, he knows my words. Come on, no. Plots, good. Plots, good. Good plots, 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 good plots. No, uh -uh, not yet. No, we'll try again. Good boy, he wants to play. Good boy, we'll try again, I know, no jumping. Let's do it one more time. Good boy, plots, good, plots, good. Good. Plots. Good. Now you just saw um, I moved a little bit further and he knows to lie down. So he crawled, which is great because now I know that he can lie down and he knows it means the entire body. So I don't have to sit him anymore, which is a great progression for the dog. Good boy. Good boy. Let's do it one more time and then go play. Come on. Come on. Plots. Good. Plots. Good plots. Come on. Plots. Good. Plots. Good. Good boy. Yes. 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 Come on. Come on. Good boy. Yay. Come on.
Good. So, one other thing is that when I just introduce the word to the dog, I just keep saying it. But once, he, once you see that he he gets it, like today he he does it much better. He was already crawling, which is a progress. Um, so he knows to control the entire body, not just the front. Uh, then the timing with my word to the to the position should be different. I should say the word he needs to do the command. Right now what I'm doing is that he's already down there and I'm simply um, giving him treats with the word. So he understands when I say plots, the treat is coming. Obviously, uh, he's not association treat with the word because, uh, well, he's smart enough to know that. Uh, and plus we've been training with other commands so he knows that we're doing something, he needs to figure out his own body. And I think he's doing a great job. Stop chewing your toy, you won't have any. Good boy.